Hello, we are from SMA Negeri 2 Lamongan. My name is Nabila Ika Safitri and my name is Nar Nurfadia. We are proud to introduce our research with the title Stylosan, the combination of Lothar Plainways, Borasus Labelifer, and Garson Leaf Muntinia Talagura as a substitute for an organic styrofoam. The accumulation of styrofoam waste is increasing day by day. The lifestyle of the world community use of styrofoam and plastic material has become a habit. The use of styrofoam can be used for various purposes, primarily as a disposable food and beverage container. The reason people use styrofoam is because styrofoam is easily available and the price is cheap, so that many people use it because it practice yield and disposable. But in fact, when it becomes waste, styrofoam is not easily to decompose. It takes about 500 to 1 million years to decompose by soil. In addition, styrofoam contains a harmful substance. The substance is polystyrene. The polystyrene substance in styrofoam will melt together with health from food or others. Those substance enter the body and cause health problems, such as impaired vision, hearing, nervous system, and can trigger cancer. In the library, we are looking for solutions to reduce the accumulation of styrofoam waste, which is difficult to decompose and has danger for the environment and health. We look for reference to make styrofoam from natural materials. We found that London fronts and kerosene leaf can be used as the main ingredients for making organic styrofoam. Therefore, we go to library to find the best solution for the accumulation styrofoam waste. Lontar, Borasus flavor is a plant that belongs to the palm group. Lontar trees have a height of 25 to 30 meters. Lontar trees are single seeded plants. It has a trunk diameter of around 40 to 50 centimeters. The leaves of the lontar plants are fan shapes. Here we use the fronts of the Lontar Plain, which is one of characteristic Lamongan city, especially Pachiran area and many Lontar fronts ends up as a waste. Next is Kersen, or we as Lamongan people often call it Keres. In this research, what is needed from Kersen is the leaves from which the fiber will be taken. The fiber content of Kersen leaves is 18.52%. Kersen is a shrub plant with characteristics that go up to 12 meters high. In general, Kersen grows in Indonesia around 3 to 6 meters. This fruit is classified as a nutritional fruit because it continues to produce and flower throughout the year. Kersen is round with a bright color and has a sweet taste and aroma. We started this research from September 2023 to February 2024. And this research was considered in the biology laboratory of SMA Negeri Dua Lamongan and the research home. Prepare tools and materials to make stylosan. Wash the lontar fronts until clean. Dry the lontar fronts. Divide the stem into several parts. Create the metropy check and lontar front screening. And this is the result. Wash Kersen leaves. Dry Kersen leaves. Pure the Kersen leaves. And this is the result. Prepare lontar fronts that have been finely shredded. Lontar fronts are measured by mass on a digital balance according to the comparison measurement. Lontar fronts have been measured. Kersen leaf that have been finely measured. Mix the lontar fronts and kersen leaf that have been measured in one bowl. After that, stir until evenly distributed using a spoon. After mixing, add enough water and ethanol and stir evenly until the mixture of lontar fronts and kersen leaves dissolves. When it has dissolved, prepare the aluminum foil and put the mixture on it, leveling the styloson filled with a spoon. Cover with aluminum foil and iron the styloson. Pre-drying process. Measure the styloson with a ruler and trim it using scissors.
and after that we do flexure durability test the second styrofoam damage index third styrofoam thickness test fourth grammatical calculation with stylus and organic styrofoam is from Mundar France and Kerosene leaf as a substitute for an organic styrofoam, which is known to help adverse effect ranging from the environment and health. Now, we invite you to protect the environment by getting used to using organic styrofoam, which is environmentally friendly and easily to decompose. With a healthy environment, we can create a healthy life and not cause excessive waste. Therefore, it is expected that the existence of stylus as a substitute for an organic styrofoam can support and contribute to realizing a healthy environment. That's all from us. Thank you for your attention and sorry if we have a mistake. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. See you!